folks, Vanek Sonic here for the uh, next part and the uh, last stretch of my Pokemon Brown Let's Play. Um, this is post commentary, um, and I'm, here I'm showing you my team because there are some level differences between this video and the last one, uh, probably a little bit. I, I'm not sure by how much uh, because I had to go back and um, get back to this point at, in between the recording sessions because I forgot to save. Uh, I also show you my items because they're they're slightly different. Um, again, probably not by much. It just I had to heal a little bit more due to criticals and whatnot. But um, yeah, <laughs> this is actually the uh, what is it? Fourth attempt at me recording the uh, the audio just today because uh, the last couple times I just couldn't think of anything to say. It's been let's like what am I supposed to say? It's been a long time since I recorded. Um, well, not recorded, do it done on uh, commentary. I've had the videos for quite some time now, but I'm gonna talk more about that in an update video, which probably went up before this. I haven't recorded it yet though, but um, yeah. Um, as you can see here, I don't know if it was noticeable in the last part, like, because like I said, I haven't seen it in a while. I guess I should have watched the other part before this, but oh well. Um, I am sort of under leveled for this part of the game, for this point. Uh, you usually don't see Pokemon this high uh, level uh, in Pokemon games. I think the only time you ever see level 80 Pokemon was in the uh, Red Battle in Mount Silver in. I'm not sure if it would have been in Silver, or go Silver and Gold, but I know in uh, Crystal. I'm pretty sure in Crystal they were that high a level, and I'm not sure if it's the whole team. I know P I know his Pikachu was. It was 81, but uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure uh, at this point I could have guessed. I guess I could have trained a little bit more, but well, like I said, I had to re-record re this, and I was sort of at this point I was sort of getting an not annoyed. I, I had to for the last couple of recordings I had had to redo it everything from like a couple of videos before because I kept forgetting to save or I'd save and for some reason I when I go back to continue it didn't it wasn't there for some reason I don't know I probably probably forgot to record so obviously uh, for those of you who well I guess even if you haven't recorded before it does get pretty annoying to have to go back and redo everything all the time so I just sort of wanted to get through this and Heck, Pokemon games, you, I, there's, uh, if you watch other Let's Players, there's lots of Let's Players that go under level. That's actually something you see a lot in Let's Plays. I haven't really done that in this, because it's not something I usually do, but, um, I'm pretty sure I could do it. It's not, it's not like, it's impossible. Once you, once you know what you're doing, it's fairly simple. Uh, you don't want to go too under level, though. Like, I'm, I think my, I'm, like, seven levels difference. And then I've got one Pokemon that's level 80, so, but going to really, um, like really under level like if I went here with level 60s I would be destroyed um, with oh, unless I use a lot of items but even then um, I guess there's people that might be able to do that uh, but I, I couldn't um, yeah Undine is 81 that's my highest member of my team right now um, with um, Terra and, and um, Ayami being the weakest at this current moment um, if you notice there, I switched, uh, that's actually why I switched Dugtrio at <sighs> Terra and at the beginning of this battle, because I wanted to get, um, some experience, um, for her, and that's a good way, that's, that's how people usually train weaker Pokemon, you put them in the front and then you switch them out, they don't get all the experience, but they get quite a bit, another way is experience share, but, I guess it works, but I just, well, for one, I don't I don't know if it's even in this game, but I don't have it for one. So, or maybe I do, but I just didn't use. I'm not 100 percent sure. Um, yeah, but uh, usually early game, that's what you do. Like um, with Magikarp, you have to do that because it knows knows attacks. Pokemon like routes that have no attacks at the beginning, so things like that. Um, obviously, um, as you can tell it didn't level up I probably wasn't as close to I th as I thought to a level up but oh well it's not that big of a deal I believe I use Undine for the rest of this battle oh no that was the last Pokemon I <laughs> I didn't pay attention to the um, number of Pokemon left but um, I can't say remember if I said this in the video but this is um, a team rocket base it's uh, the end game basically there's supposed to be some new uh, guess you'd say boss, so, 
yeah, we're not sure who that is. Well, I know who it is, but I'm not going to spoil it. Uh, you will find out soon enough. But, uh, this is a pretty large place. It's on the scale of, uh, Silvco, I think, which is funny because it sort of got the same, I think that's the same, t uh, floors. Uh, like, actual, like, tile style. I think it looked, like, that's the, ins what it looks like inside. And there I got a TM-36, which is Sludge Bomb, which at this point is, well, not this point, in the point, at the point of, when was it introduced? The second generation? It was the most powerful poison move. Well, actual attack, because besides that, the only other poison attack was Poison Sting, which, while it had a lot of power points, and it was pretty good for accuracy, it just didn't really have anything. But a lot of Pokemon, I don't think a lot of Pokemon learn Sludge Bomb, uh, well, by level up anyways, but I taught it to Terra there, because, uh, so, um, well, especially in the later generations, you see a lot of non-poison grass types, and which makes grass actually pretty weak to, uh, poison, super effective against it, which is sort of weird, but I... But, um, I guess it makes sense. I guess it's sort of like, it, if you get, put poison on a plant, it will wilt sort of thing. Um, yeah, uh, that guy's saying they're making counterfeit Master Balls there. Uh, as you can see, though, that the, I guess it's, uh, text limitations. I don't know why he just didn't fit on the next time. I guess it would have looked odd. I don't, I don't know, but, uh, he ended up uh, doing that. It looks sort of weird, I guess. Um, yeah. A lot of, um, a lot of empty space here. And another thing, um, I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in the last video, but we find a lot of technical, um, technical machines or TMs to this, at this point in the game, which is really weird, because it's the end game. You're not, you're not going to really be doing much after this. Unless, uh, he expected people, maybe there's something I missed, I, I don't know, but, um, yeah. It seems, but, but they're pretty powerful TMs, so I guess they're useful for, for this place. I guess they'd figure he figured well at this point you might not have like all these really powerful moves and you might be a little under level so he, he throw in some uh easy to uh, find powerful moves i don't know or maybe it's just he forgot and he ended up putting them all in at the end um not a, it's not a big deal but yeah you see the levels are even getting higher here like uh like this is this is even higher than um the last trainer which is max was 80 well all his pokemon were 83 but i should easily be able to take care of this um, besides Machamp's power, it's not, it doesn't really do anything else. It's got pretty weak defenses, and I don't think it's really fast either. Uh, but then Charizard's pretty fast, so. Um. I guess something else I could talk about is, uh, Pokemon uh, Black and White are out by this point. Yeah, I'm, I'm recording this the Sunday at the end of this, well, spring break. I don't know. It might be different for you, but, um, the date is... Oh, the 20th. It's actually the first day of spring today, too. Which is, uh, cool, I guess. I guess it's interesting. Um, but, yeah, I've got, uh, both versions. Um, it's pretty cool. But, speaking of TMs, though, um, I don't know if this was revealed by the time I, um, recorded this, but you can, uh, reuse TMs in the new game, which sort of doesn't make, makes no sense to me. But, uh, yeah, they're pretty good games, um, not as far as I'd like to be, uh, or would usually be. I haven't been playing video games a lot. We basically, I just play video games with my friends, and, well, really, I don't, I play my Game Boy once in a while, but I haven't played my Game Boy in a while, so, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm, re I'm recovering my team here because, obviously, I'm underleveled, so I want to try to keep my Pokemon at, uh, the, um, well, pretty close to max HP. Though I don't know why I didn't uh, heal Ayami. I guess I didn't think I'd have to... I think it was Ayami that wasn't healed. I, maybe I didn't think I'd have to uh, use her for a while. I don't know. Not 100% sure. Um, but yeah. Um, why am I waiting here? Oh, I must have been saying something. Oh! Oh, I was deciding whether to go down to those stairs or continue on this path at the moment. Because I was worried about missing something and then have to do a lot of backtracking. I, that's what I think it would have been. I, I can't remember. That would make logical sense. Unless I was talking about something specific. But, oh well. Uh, if I was, it, um, probably irrelevant by this point. Because um, I'm looking at the timer. I still got quite a bit of time in this video. I don't know why I would have uh, s s like s done my outro at this point. Um... Oh well, it's something. 
Um, don't think anything else happened to the video, though. I don't know. I I would just cut it here, but I don't know. There could be there could be more. I guess if there's not anything else, I might just cut it here. Uh, so yeah, it doesn't look like anything else is gonna happen. Uh, if it does, I'll. I'll add another little bit of commentary to the end of this video. If not, uh, I will see you in the next video, folks. Uh, I'm going to be recording the audio for that, too. Um, I'll explain everything about what's happened in the break and all that in an update video, which would have went up before this. I haven't recorded it yet, though. Uh, so, yeah. I'll see you in the next video, folks. Peace.